How's it going, YouTubers? Frugal Fanboy here, and today I'm going to take my Yoga Tablet 2 for a bit of a ride. Uh, the reason I'm doing that is because the Yoga Tablet 2 is something that, um, you know, wasn't a big selling point for me, but it is a feature, is that the Yoga Tablet 2 has GPS uh, on board. It's got a GP GPS antenna and GPS radio. Uh, that means uh, that, of course, you can uh, actively track your location. Now, if you're like me, when you first hear that, it's kind of like, okay, well, what's the point of having a, uh, a GPS radio on my tablet? Uh, I've got my phone. Um, I probably always, you know, have, you know, Wi-Fi or, or some type of connectivity. So why exactly w would that benefit me? Well, there is a reason. You can use the Here Maps application and have an offline map which stores your streets and your, your directions and your points of interest, uh, allowing you to search for things nearby with that, all without using uh, a data connection. Now, that's pretty cool. Um, a few scenarios where I th see that that can be uh, helpful. And what if you're flying? What, what if you're uh, in, in route to your, your, your destination and you kind of want to see what's going on? Well, before you get on your trip, you could go ahead and download the, the uh, map for you, the area you're, you're going to be uh, staying in, you're going to be visiting. Um, and uh, you could then find your hotel. You could find the restaurants around, uh, take a look at the reviews, the buzz about it. Uh, again, all without a data connection. Uh, that can prove to be kind of handy. You're not tethered. You're not, you don't find that you have to have that data connection. Another thing that this tablet doesn't have is the ability to put in a SIM card uh, to get um, LTE or some type of data on the go. So again, that makes it to where an offline map system um, coupled with GPS can, can come in pretty useful. Uh, so I'll, I'll go ahead and fire that up just to take a quick look. And I just wanted to kind of show you, first of all, I'm not connected. As you can see there, I've got uh, no connection. So I'm not connected uh, to Wi-Fi or anything. Um, I didn't turn on airplane mode because I think that that would turn off my GPS radio as well. Uh, so let's see what happens when we fire up here maps and see if it finds finds where we are. And then I'm going to take, take just a little bit of time and head down the road and, uh, you know, see how the directions work. And there you see I've got I've got a prompt that says uh, to make sure that uh, flight mode is turned off and check your data Wi-Fi connection. Regardless of that fact, I still have a map of the area. Much like uh, Google Maps, you can tilt and you can kind of you know, pan that way. But here I am. So it finds my location uh, pretty well. So let's go ahead and just, uh, let's say I want to take a trip down the road to Jack in the Box. And again, we're, we're offline. So we'll see if we're able to still find locations nearby. So all without a connection, it still finds my points of interest, areas, things nearby, without needing to be connected to the internet. Again, to me, that's kind of really, it's a, it's a big deal. But let's say, for instance, you're on a road trip. You can now have this running, and then you can uh, you can look up look up uh, points of interest on, on the way. So I'm going to take a look at, okay, so this looks to be the closest one. And I'm going to get directions. So... As you can see, it loads it up. I've got uh, an itemized list. And now, mind you, there's no uh, voice guided turn by turn uh, here, at least not in this update. I'm, I'm hoping my fingers are crossed that uh, they'll add that sometime in the future. But as of right now, it's just uh, listed um, directions. So what I'll do is let's just uh, fire up the old miss. And uh, we'll see how well it uh, follows the route. Now, obviously, it's not anywhere near the best idea to film and drive. The disclaimer is I take no uh, responsibility for anyone who decides to try this at home. Uh, actually, my advice is not to try this at home. And I'm not going to do it for very long. I just wanted to show you that it does indeed uh, track your location. So, as mentioned, there's a few things you could do. Uh, obviously, it's not the 
best idea for the driver to be so concerned with uh, directions and that's why those turn-by-turn -turn voice guided navigation systems are, are ideal also should get when that happens but uh, as you may be able to see it, it's got me uh, it's got me tracked but what you might want to do is you have uh, your passenger uh, take control of, of the uh, of the tablet and of the directions and kind of give you you know, kind of a modified uh, turn by turn. So they can tell you, all right, you kind of make a left as you turn up there. And then they can rotate the, the map to kind of follow your orientation. Again, it would be nice if uh, Here Maps includes that in an update uh, to where it does it on its own. But as for now, uh, at least you can get uh, directions to um, your, your point of interest or your destination uh, without having to be connected to the internet. And again, to me, that adds a lot of value to a tablet because. Um, it, 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 it just becomes another thing that you can do. Um, so I'm at a stoplight. Take this opportunity to see if, yep, and this is about right, and that's about where I am. So uh, that'll about wrap it up. I don't plan to do this all the way there, but there you can see it's just kind of been a, a quick look at uh, Here Maps. If you want me to go into further detail as to uh, what the uh, mapping software uh, is all about, um, I can do that um, from going into downloading the offline maps and, and some of the features of here maps, or you can just download it and hey, give it a whirl on your own. Uh, but that's kind of been a, a quick look at uh, here maps on the yoga tablet too. Uh, hit me up with questions, comments, concerns, aside from the fact that I'm driving and uh, videoing. Um, and uh, hey, I'll respond to you as soon as I can. A uh, light screen. And so that'll about do it for now. Y'all take care.